Santa Barbara is known for a lot of things. Its beaches, perfect climate, you name it. But what a lot of people don't realize is that Santa Barbara has a rich Spanish history. Ironically, the same things that bring tourists here every year also brought the first explorers to Santa Barbara. It's people like Juan Rodriguez Cabrillo that made Santa Barbara the place it is today. These first Spanish explorers managed to colonize one of the first places in California. Some of the history is obvious, like the Santa Barbara Mission, but not all of it is obvious. Many buildings and houses that still remain from the period of Spanish colonization are tucked away in the woods where no one would think to look. Most people that live in Santa Barbara miss on some of the greatest things this place has to offer. Places like the Mission are still some of the greatest works of architecture to this day. The Mission also hosts lots of community events, which is nice because it brings everyone closer to the Spanish roots of Santa Barbara. Other places like the Spanish Presidio have been retrofitted into museums. I'm glad that someone would take the time to educate people about historic Santa Barbara. And since there is so much history in Santa Barbara, there is always something new for me to find. I like Santa Barbara because it has so much to offer. Whether that means getting up to watch the sunrise over the ocean, hiking in the mountains, or just relaxing. If I could live anywhere, I wouldn't think twice about choosing Santa Barbara.